welcome to What I Ate Wednesday, What We Ate Wednesday, Carlos's birthday edition. Today is October 3rd, it's Carlos's birthday. I just finished my workout and now I'm going to make him some eggs and toast. Actually, I think I'm going to make him a cheese omelette and toast. Why do I say toast? A cheese omelette and bacon. Feliz cumpleaños, Sati. Happy birthday, love. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm making your breakfast. Bacon. And, well, these are just going to be scrambled eggs. I'm making you an omelette with Swiss cheese. Because you like oh, that cheese, right? I do. Yeah. Carlos picked me up from work. Yeah. I didn't film, but at work I had a cheese bun. And we just finished sampling oh, this. Laura Secourt butter cream fudge. It was so delicious. Delicious. I have a maple one and a chocolate one here as well, which we might try. Did you film your lunch? I did not. Oh. It's Wednesday. What a Wednesday. Wednesday. What did you have? I had some leftover chicken, leftover beef, and some honey ham sticks. Okay. And a beer. Well, I'm going to have a snack when I get home, which I'll film, and then tonight we're having really, really good meat. I bought Carlos really nice meat for his birthday. I spent like $30, $40 on two cuts of meat. Mm -hmm. I hope it's good. I hope so too. We're going to try the maple. Oh, oh, take a little bite. Oh, we're moving. We were stuck in a train, that's why I was like so bored and wanting to eat this. Mm. It's good. Prefer the other one or this one? I think I prefer the other one. But it's still mm, fudge. Really it's good. still good. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I prefer the other one too. I'm gonna have my lunch, lunch snack now. I'm having an English muffin with peanut butter, and I have decided to try this. Sky Icelandic yogurt. This is the plain. And I added in some of the no sugar added raspberry jam and some walnuts, as you can see there. I'm gonna have this, and then the next time you'll see us will be at our magnificent dinner. I'm just pouring Carlos's brownie into the pan here. Oh, it's my brownie. It's our, our like, I don't know. It's not our recipe. We got it off the internet. I'll, I'll link it below, but it's the recipe that we always use, and it's just the best brownie. Like, honestly, aside from the two bite brownies that you buy here in Winnipeg, these are the best brownies we've ever had. Like, don't you think they're better than the brownies in Barranquilla? These are delicious. Uh, the brownies in La Casa? I really like brownies in La Casa, though. Yeah, but Carlos, these are so good. We Biased. always do a good dog brownies. Maybe because it's like sentimental for you, the brownies in La Casa. It must be. So we're doing this and Carlos is learning how to do a reverse sear on the meat. Maybe mm -hmm. I'll, I'll film a little bit of that. Carlos just opened his meat and he says it's beautiful. This even cut ribeye steak, so fatty. I mean, I have no idea what a beautiful piece of meat looks like, but I guess that's it. That's it, that's what you want. You want it marbled, you want it fatty and nice and juicy and evenly cut. Uh, and why don't you check the other one now? What is it again? That's a ribeye. Mm -hmm. and this is a tenderloin. It shouldn't be as fatty, but more tender. Is it beautiful? This is what they use for filet mignon. Is it beautiful? It is beautiful. Oh, <laughs> I hope it's going to be tasty. It will be tasty. Okay, we're gonna put the steaks in the oven. Ooh! So these are Carlos's, and then these are two for my family. But they're really good. Yeah, they are. Those are from Sobeys. These are from my work, Piazza Nardi. They look good! We'll put that in the oven and... We're gonna put it in the oven, 250 degrees Fahrenheit, for 25 minutes, half an hour, and we'll take them out and sear them. Oh wow, okay. And then the burgers are also for like me and my family. <laughs> Alright, to celebrate Carlos's birthday, I bought him 
Champagne. I bought you Boris Uber Estorps. It's our first time trying it. Oh. And we're gonna pop the bottle open. Okay, let's not break the light bulb. Well, that's why we should use this to you just oh. wiggle it off. Okay. Oh, <laughs> this breaks me out opening up champagne bottles. Where's the sparkly? Okay. It's gonna open. Ah! It's gonna do this just in case. The last time I almost took out my eye. Ah, oh, bravo! Going in. Carlos is going to attempt the sear. Oh boy. Oh man. How long do you sear it for? About one minute each side. Like okay. That. These are the sirloins from Sobeys. So, this is the steak that Carlos made. It's cooked very evenly throughout. Was it medium rare? Was it? That's medium rare, yeah. Medium rare. Alyssa, how is it? Good. Mom? Very good. Dad? I've never seen a steak cooked this... Beautifully? Well, in my life. And then Carlos over here Better just life. has the... His steaks going. Yeah, they're big. They're big, big motherfuckers. Good luck with those. Okay, Carlos has his meat in front of him, and I can't wait to see his reaction when he tries it. Let's try it. Okay, I'll start with the tenderloin. And this really is very, we should bed. show it. Um, Here. Medium rare. Mm -hmm. All throughout. Mmm. Mmm. Real good. Happy with it? Mm-hmm. Mm. Delicious. It's so soft. Oh. Mm. Kind of and then we'll cut it to I'm just gonna turn it so, so you can see. <laughs> this is the the rib the, the ribeye, right? The ribeye, yeah. This was cooked right, medium. Medium. Perfect medium. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cut that up. Perfect. Is that the ribeye? No, that's the one. No, no. Mm. Oh, <laughs> Is that the best? Reba is just so flavorful. Oh, awesome. Well, I'm glad you like it, baby. Happy mm. birthday. That is me, yeah. <laughs> There's just... Uh, we just have a kale salad here, and I just wanted to try this, pairing it with the champagne. The salad's good. Very fresh. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Lovely. Mm-hmm. Very nice. Good. Unfortunately, Carlos did not try the wine before he ate the meat. He's only gonna try it after, and it's this wine here. Yeah, it's sure. from Casa Roja called Ledrone. It's from Mencia, a Spanish wine. What do you I think? I can't smell anything because I don't have the flavors of the meat. Okay, that's all right. Taste it and tell us how it is. It's really like tender. Mmm. Mm. So good. It goes so well with the meat. That's what they mm. told me. That's a ribeye. Delicious. Ribeye? Yeah. Beef power one. Mm. Mm. That's how when I was in Lloyd with Darren and my mom and my sister, that's how he did his roast. Like that. How is it, Alyssa? It was good. What a scale from one to ten, how that's good? That's we kept saying it was ten. So oh, you baby, ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. It all depends on what kind of... So I've tried the Ladrone by itself, which I think is phenomenal. It is so good. And now I'm going to try it with the meat. I'm going to try it with the top... The sir what is it? What is this? Top sirloin? Yes. <clears throat> the top sirloin, yeah. yeah. Oh my god, that is really gross. Oh, that makes oh. Too, <laughs> baby, this is so soft. Yeah. Okay. The top sirloin or the tenderloin? <clears throat> the tenderloin. The tenderloin is the softest. Oh my god. It's really, really good. Now with the lime. Mm. 
It's a good pairing. It's a very nice <laughs> pairing. Okay. I'd recommend it in the store. <laughs> it's not the best pairing we've ever done, but it's a good pairing. It's a good pairing. It's a good one. I'm such a dodo. I forgot to film us eating the brownie. Anyway, I you saw me making the brownie earlier in the video, and that was Carlos's dessert. It was really good. I actually like the brownie. Best brownies ever. We had brownie with he had a glass of milk, and I had oh my, it was so good. I had like three quarters unsweetened vanilla almond milk, then with a quarter of coffee. Whew, it was delicious. The brownie was good, but I wish it were gooier. Yeah. The thing is, we used the same recipe that we used in Colombia, and I think because the ovens are different, it turns out gooier in Colombia than it did here, so I think we just need to leave it in for less time here. Yeah. Anyway, that was our What We Ate Wednesday. That was Carlos's birthday. We had really good food, really good times, really good chats. Yeah. Happy birthday, my love. Yeah. I love you. I love you too. And... Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.